Hello and welcome back to some more of EVE Online with me, the Green Dragon. So, we have our material equipped, we have all of our repair tools in case we get damaged, so we can, you know, take a few hits on the armor if we need to. And uh, let's see what mission you offer us. Blockade? Is it gonna be blockade? Oh, you want me to fight Galente? Fuck no, they already hate me. Give me something else. Against the Minmatar. <sighs> Can't really refuse, can I? Uh, I assume the Minmatar dislike me, but they don't dislike me that much. I guess I'm gonna go for it. Okay, I have stuff in my bio, right? For... Deal Minmatar Explosive. So, um, what is it? Phased Plasma that we want for this? No, that's thermal. We want fusion buns. Yeah, boom, bitch. So I'm supposed to kill a Minmatar diplomat. <laughs> How fun! How very fun. Okay, let's undock and go for it, I suppose. You fucker, you Gale. Sorry, you Kaldari fucker. <sighs> Okay, rest is on. We get what? Less than 60% on everything except explosive. Ah, oh, that's fucking epic. And where the fuck is this fucked up? It's supposed to be locked to that. Alright, that's because I changed to the full screen mode. I have these usually hunt hidden under the chats and with an edge sticking out so that I can drag them out nowadays when I need them. Why are the effects so bloody quiet, though? There. Okay. And, uh... Onwards to the pew-pews! You, you are gonna let me in, right? You don't mind me using a battleship for this, cause if you... The frag... The frag was that sound... That sounds like something disconnecting from my computer, but that couldn't be it, because everything is... Okay, lots of ships. Okay. Let's just... Get close and say hi. Oh, you're gonna target me? That's so rude. Don't you think that's rather rude? They are rather far off though, so they're gonna have a tough time doing much of anything. What are you in? A freighter? Oh yeah, you try that shit with me. You try. Open fire! Suck it, bitch! Oh, you are not going anywhere. Webs. Fuck yeah. Now, if only we can stop in that. Holy... This thing is pretty damn nimble. From the way it was warping and turning, I thought it would... It seemed pretty... You know, sluggish, but no, it's pretty damn good. It will do. It will do nicely. I'm just gonna slightly obliterate it before anyone can help him. Hit and run, right? I'm just gonna... Break the diplomat and then we're gonna go. There's no reason really to stick around after that. He's there. Look at that damage. And they're all what? Disengaging? Well, if you're gonna do that, that's fine. Let's test this out, see how quickly. Yeah, not that quickly. I mean, we are right here, right? Why the fuck not? Wow, that's taking a while. Kill. Shoot. I have a tough time hurting it, I expect, but... Eek. Yeah, that's starting to sting. You know, 
I'm not sure I want to stay in here. This seems like the kind of mission you're not supposed to actually find. You know? So why don't we just go? Why don't we just accelerate the warp and go? Because we're about to start taking... We are taking armor damage and... Who need that shit, right? Nope. Later, bitches. Later. Oh, it's my phone! It's my bloody phone with its, its stupid charger cable. Yep. So... Oh okay, yeah, we'll be relying on our buffer a whole whole lot, it seems, because our shield region does leave something to be re desired. Hmm. Well... We'll look into a better shield module in a while. Okay. How much do you take? Really, how much do you take? 30 of these are yours, the rest is... So I need to get this under 30, so that I can run everything pretty much continuously, I expect. Well, whatever. It's done. The Minmatar are now gonna hate my guts. Right? I expect they are. I mean... No, that didn't actually do much. Okay, what have you got for me now? You fuckers! Fine. Jesus Christ. And that's the thing, it's the first fracking mission, and I want to actually get those standings up, right? So... Whatever, what am I supposed to deal against Galente? Let's... What do... Kinetic Thermal... Uh, so that's... Fusion... Right? Oh no, I have Fusion on, I need... I need... Uh, plasma. Still not familiar with all the Minimitar ammo types, of course. I really want to find a way to make give this ship a lot of endurance, you know? Active armor tank might actually be better for that, ultimately. But that's what I want. I want this ship to have endurance. Staying power like there's no tomorrow, right? Passive shield tank is, in my opinion, really good for that because it isn't dependent upon my ability to actually have a some sort of capacitor, right? I'm just gonna head on in and pew a few peoples. And I'm gonna launch my You're jamming me. Are you fucking serious? You're actually jamming me. I mean that's that's rude as all fuck. Kill No game. Turn that off, we should be well within range by the time we get... Kill! There we go. Eat hot plasma death. And suck it down, please. Stop. Yes, you can jam me all you want, but I'm gonna lock your... No, I'm not gonna be doing storyline missions for Kaldari because that makes the other races hate me and I uh, I really rather wouldn't have that happen. Jesus Christ! Okay, maybe going for the main target so quickly, not the best of ideas. These missions used to be easier. Level 3 is actually. Or maybe this is just a tough chain of missions, so to speak. Still, ouch! I don't actually have to warp out here. In a battleship, no less. I mean, maybe my fitting just sucks. It's certainly a possibility. No, 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 you repairing little shit. You're gonna die in a fire here. You're not fracking going anywhere. Okay, we have a station, wherever. You know what? Yes, uh, a line too. Just to be good and ready. Okay, 
my children. Oh. You killed one of my drones, you dicks. Get over here. Oh, wait. You know what, no. Let's dock up and then we can come back and... Yeah, screw the load, we're just gonna go. Oh, the Galente don't hit me for that, eh? Hey? My actual standing didn't go any lower. That's curious. I guess we can come back in and clear out the rest of that trash then. Which I admittedly might have made sense to start with, instead of, you know, letting them pummel me. But oh well, mistakes may well have been made. You know what? I'm curious now as to what loot was in there. You know, I want to go back and find out. Docking permission requested. And yeah, we might... I mean... Docking request accepted. With the shields I have, I have a lot of buffer as is, right? Going in first. And... You know, act armor tank might not be a bad idea. Do I want to go back in there? You know what, no. I really don't. Um, I lost a hammerhead. So, um... I'm gonna actually buy myself a goodish supply of them. And there's 61 in here. That sounds good. That sounds about right. I'm gonna be running missions out here, we might as well overkill, especially since I will be using these hammerheads a lot and... Wait, next mission. What do you want me to do? <clears throat> Finding and killing a secret agent, silencing an informant, no less. Yeah, the... Okay, the material stock Okay, what's the sh passive shield recharge rate on a hurricane? Stock-wise, seconds. Yeah, it's significantly faster. And when you add shield extenders and other things, like, um, you know, those uh, shield relays, it really tends to add up to a lot of passive recharge. There's no way I would be able to get the same kind of passive recharge on this ship, I think. It's just not gonna happen. And that's fine. If that's the way it is, then that's the way it's gonna be. It's okay. I'll think of something. Hmm. What if I add a reactive armor hardener? Because those things adapt to damage, right? Two explosive pumps, one antikinetic pump, one thermal hardener of some kind. Get some sort of decent boost to armor strength. I might switch this to armor tanking. You know, how the reactive armor hardener works is it um, takes power, right? Much like the adaptive invulnerability field. And it starts you at 15 percent of resistance for everything, but as you take damage, and as the thing cycles, it slowly adapts to give you more resistance to damage you're taking and less to other types, right? So, um, as that goes on, you slowly adapt to things, and for missioning at least, that would make a lot of sense. For sleepers, not so much, but as a, for a mission fit, that might be the best way to do it. But if I add armor, I lose speed, if I add armor rigs. And I really don't like that. I really, really don't like the idea of losing speed. If that's the case, I might just turn this into a flying tank and just ditch the nanofibers and everything. The whole point is to have a fast ship. Right? I'll repair the little bit of armor damage that I took between videos. It's fine. How much standing have I gained here? Little bit? A eh, little bit. That's fine then. Two missions, little bit of standing. Like, point ten. That's fine. But today we're just gonna be doing missioning on our own, since nobody from the corp is actually online. Cause you know, reasons. And instantly, I am really sorry about not there not being any videos for so long, but... 
it's really two things. I had a nasty cold and I have been busy trying to catch up with schoolwork. Because, you know. Well, you know, university work anyway. Because, you know, reasons. Can I hit you from this distance? Yes, I can, you little fuck. Die in a fire. Oh yes, you get close, that's fine. You come right at me, straight on, that's fine. Ooh, 1200. Critical strike. Well, structures. Structure hit, anyway. And you, my dear bastards, are next. Hey -o. Launching hammerheads. Incidentally, I have a tracking camera enabled with a custom set position so that the target I am focused on gets focused on. Hey, this is taking far too long. We have those bastards targeted. Let's swoop in and unleash some plasma death. Do I have a line in my bio for drones? Eh, it doesn't look like I do. I really don't care either. They'll die easy enough from plasma. It's fine. Okay, that's the final cycle we need to do. I said fire. Fire? Well, it's too late now. They're already trying to orbit me. Kill. Fast orbiting little fuckers. Well, that's why we have drones. And a goodish supply of them for situations like this, right? That's why we have both these little hobgoblins and some hammerheads, right? You know, for those situations where we want to be in right in someone's face. I think we want to be right in someone's face, and we should probably have our uh, invulnerability field on. Okay, now he should be trying to run straight away from us, and we can just unleash death and ending on him. Excellent. You next. Web. Kill. Pew pew. For great justice, pew. Pew for great justice. Yeah, it looks like the drones are ripping him up. He's moving that quickly, even with the bloody... webs. Or was only one of them active? Why the fuck would only one of them be active? That's bullshit. You know what, you're gonna run away from me in a straight line, that's fine, I don't mind. Double web. Lock you down, you little bastard. There we go. Boom, bitch. Okay. Recover these. Return to the drone bay. Shields repaired. Good. And activate gate. And let's just micro warp drive to it. That will be nice and fast since this ship is pretty damn nimble. Nimbler than my hurricane. It's weird though that the Battle cruiser could be well. It's not necessarily tankier, but it does have more region, and that does play a good role. Then again, with the extra damage this thing does, at least against sleeper cruisers, this should be significantly more effective in its own way. We'll see how it goes. I want a nimble ship. I really would prefer a nimble ship to a not so nimble one. And going, 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 going. It's pretty nice too. Sleek. The hurricane and this too, to some extent, has that uh, wedge-shaped, vaguely reminiscent of a star destroyer. Well, it's like a bastard, half-breed child of a Mon Calamari cruiser and a star destroyer. Really, it's gonna be cool. Three mercenary commanders. Okay. The kind of targets we're built to destroy. Excellent. Larger. Easier to... Hello? Oh, hello. It's gonna be a fight then, is it? Oh, wait. 
you're right up in my face. What the fuck are you in my face for? You don't want me in my face. That's unhealthy. Damn it, we're gonna overshoot now. Son of a... Just gonna have to take a few hits while we get ourselves aligned for a killing blow. Get our uh, guns aligned. And I think this is good enough. Open fire. Pew pew pew! There we go, you bastards. I remember the kind of trouble you gave me in my Algoror. Not today, though. Not today, I think. Time to die. You. Next. <laughs> Whoops. Accidentally ungroup my guns. Can't have that. No, no, no. Go to him. To him, I said. Turn and go to him. Not any mercenary wing, but him. Yes, no grazing hits. Head on hits. Absolute destruction. With heavy, heavy guns. Yeah, like that. Like that. Good job. You're doing great. Good job. Good job. Boom. Oh, he dropped me something nice. Oh, he left me a gift. It's cute. Okay, we have some bullshit going on here. And we're gonna launch our hammerheads and uh, deal with this. Can we hit you? Not likely, I expect. Oops, on him. Those other guys are slowly moving closer, but... Okay, you. Let's just move towards them. Don't need to fire our guns. In fact, we can just reload them right now. Crap, I forgot to bring sensor backup things, and sooner or later some douche nozzles gonna jam me. I just know it. Oh well. Something else we're gonna handle at some point. When it comes up. This should be good. And pew. For great justice, pew. There we go. Webs. And those are just going in. Excellent. Target the rest of them. Excellent. Yeah. Okay. A lot of engagements we'll be able to handle like this. With just our buffer and then we'll bear our shields between fights or something. Finish him off. How the frag did I miss that? Shouldn't he be moving away from me? I mean, should he be trying to... Well, luckily I have drones for bullshit like that. Next target. Engage the micro warp drive. I'm gonna send my drones against the mercenary wingman right away, and I'm gonna go for the commanders myself with my heavy guns. I think that's a sensible uh, division of labor here. Damn, this thing is fast once it gets up to speed. Kill! Destroy that while I take care of these. Just get me into web range. Then things become real fun. Though I can admittedly stay a bit further off and blink at them from like 25 kilometers or 20. If I so desire, my range certainly allows for it. The range is actually better on these than it is on the neutron blasters I used on my Nagas. Which is very, very sexy. I love the range. The range is gonna be very nice. And you just kill that. That's fine, just kill it. Wow, well, you have ripped up some of my drones, but I'm not gonna bother repairing drones. There's always more where those came from. And really, just... Yeah. It's fine. It will... is fine. If some of them get destroyed, there's... I have 60 of them. There's no way I'll be able to use all of them. So it's okay. And boom. Okay. You, do you have anything good for me? Not really. Next one. Not interested. Okay, you. Don't clutter up my shit. I could pew that, I suppose. 
you know, just obliterate it with my guns, but... Or drones. Okay, just, just get through there. Use your micro warp drive if you need to, but get through that bullsh... I hate these space rocks. I've actually died because of crap like that. Oh, incidentally... Actually, I'll do that next turn. Uh, next video, but I do have some uh, stories to tell you. I have all kinds of kills. See? I've killed a procurer, an explorer, but he was asking for it, honestly. Stupidity like that should be punished. And what else? Oh yeah! I ambushed and smoked an interceptor with my Stratios. Fun times were had. Fun times were had. So now I'm up to 5 kills. Or something like that. I think it's 5 kills. Something like that. Kills were had. I've killed people. And yes, I am turning on some occasions into a heartless bastard. See? I'm learning. I'm becoming a real EVE Online player. I'm learning. Let's just repair our shields improve our situation and I'm actually god damn it that's my cat I actually it was stupid enough to leave my door unlocked god's fucking damn it speaking of I don't know if I've mentioned this before nothing right I have learned how to diffuse you know standard and superior sleeper caches you know good things good things that's good enough that's good enough and you know what, I'm gonna end the video here, thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed this, and I'll continue this mission in the next one, so uh, see you guys then, see you around.